All right, y'all, let's make some weirdness. Just because it's been a weird day, and, uh, well, I... Most of the, my, the beginning of my day spent freaking out because the board showed up uh, without notice and I told them I needed notice beforehand and they just knocked on my door and I was in the bathroom and I'm yelling, I need a minute, I need a minute. And well, you know, it started off pretty badly and then I freaked out on them and I'm like, I need a minute and took marijuana, which, uh, you know, uh, you know me, I'm trying to get off drugs, but uh, I took a whole bunch of marijuana and it calmed my ass down and I was able to become a mensch again and real person and uh and talk to everybody so uh i don't have anything really prepared today um is what i'm trying to say this is more um sorry i was just that that would have been good for that uh the firm song the radioactive It's that ring, 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 ring. So, uh, what I was going to talk about was um, the, the dude who stole, who's hooked up to the chemo pump again. Um, I, I had a bad morning, but I pulled out of it, and I was I was able to make it uh, into a better um, day all around, um, both with my insistence on trying to be better and with the help of of the people that i was dealing with and i kept telling them i'm sorry this is what happened and they kept saying do you want to reschedule i'm like no which was really pissing me off because it's like no 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 i'm trying to fight through this i want you to get this done that's what i'm trying to get to you i want to say i'm get through your thick skull but that would have been rude and um and we made it through, so uh, so we're good. Um, and I had, the only things I really had planned for for this video was um, I have been learning stuff. Um, well, please like, comment, and subscribe if you find anything here that might be even um, remotely close to uh, something. Anyway, uh, inspirational, I think, was word word I was looking for. But anyway, one of the ones was Joe Walsh. Yeah, see, I was playing, I've been playing that wrong and I just learned this. Uh uh, it's. Oh, I'm sorry, you can't even see. I was playing it like this. Uh uh. And then I was, I got the first part correct of it. But I always thought that there was a key change and there is, and he just goes over to B. So just move the whole thing up a step, you know. Anyway, hopefully that's getting a little bit better. Um, 
I've been trying to play Robert Cray. <laughs> Can't even hardly play it now, I want to sing it. You keep banging me. playing that over and over but it's supposed to be uh nothing but a woman by robert cray um now that i got into that robert cray thing because uh, i got room 13 it just got me thinking about it i will talk about this guitar at some other point in time this is one of my goodwill finds it's a baja oh sorry i get the tuner on there it's a baja guitar i'd never heard of this brand um and uh, this was another one of my 40, I think this was 40, 42, 42 or $46. Um, uh, but this is another case of, I can't believe people don't actually know what they have. Because this thing, I literally got it out the box. Um, I had to clean it just a little bit because it looked they, like they used like borax or something. I don't know. Was, or compound that they never even took off. So I hit it with a little cleaner and then lowered the action because it literally was, you know, like one of these things. So, uh, well, you know, um, so I had to lower that. And uh, everything on this, this guitar looks like it's, it's in superb order. It just needed love um i need uh, the frets seem awful nice there's not really any buzzing up and down so um that they need to be clean. the fretboard needs to be clean the frets need to be clean they probably need to be polished up a little bit not sure about the leveling i they like i said they seem pretty good but we'll check it out and see what happens and uh but like i said this is for a 40 something dollar guitar this is worth way way more than that especially if it's set up correctly it's going to be you know super it's already super nice to play and i haven't done anything with it yet so um you know and the electronics are all working fine uh it's all pretty cleaned up and you know i get it hit it with a it cleaned up as in there's not really any uh there's there's a little bit of uh road rash over here but um you know, there's not really and a little bit here and just in the in the places you would expect it and a lot and people pay a lot for quote unquote relicking these days so maybe that's just you know a feature instead of a bug um i don't know I, I i do this for the love of working on the guitars the love of uh making them play better the love of making something come alive from something that seemingly is just an inanimate object and to me that that's why i do this um if i can actually make any money off of it that'd be cool but uh i'm going by by prices you know that are out there in the market and i have not looked at these yet but just um in general i would put this at least 125 probably 150 dollar guitar um maybe more with the setup I, I haven't looked like i said i don't know how much these things are worth i don't know I haven't taken it apart. I, I couldn't tell you what kind of wood it's made of. Um, any, I couldn't tell you anything about this thing because um, I haven't looked yet. But uh, I'm going to check it out uh, along the way and uh, see what happens. And 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 I'll, most of my stuff that I put up there is just whatever I find market price. I go to Reverb and I kind of like and, and then just search around on, on Google and I kind of take like an amalgamation of them all and be like, well, that one sounds fair, you know. So um, that's pretty much all I do because I really have no clue how much these things are worth. But to me, they're, I guess, maybe worth more. Uh, um, and to other people, they're worth more. And to some people, they're not. And I, I love the opportunity to be able to take the ones that people don't think they're worth very much and, and give them something for it so they have something for it. But then take them and uh, turn them into something special, you know, or to turn them back into something special because they probably already were at one point done. Um <laughs> This still has a little uh, 
uh, um, one of those uh, plastic things from where a, a tag was on it. Um, so yeah, I, I, like I said, I don't know what, what people do with these things because this, this little tag, this is, this is crazy because this, this, this is around, um, the strings. So it's like, if you restrung this thing, uh, this wouldn't be here. So that's just crazy. Um, I, I wonder what the story is behind all this. Anyway, uh, that's it. I've been rambling a long time. I apologize if you've made it this far. Thank you very much. Um, Hopefully I'll be back tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow I get unhooked, so I might uh, either be early or late to uh, get this thing out, out of me and uh, feel better. I might not even be here tomorrow. That's why, you know, one of the, I didn't have anything today because life got in the way. And uh, this was supposed to be a short video, which I think I've been babbling on for 10 minutes now. So 11 minutes. So I'll let you all have your day back. And uh, if you actually have made it this far, thank you very much. And uh, always look up. He's there for you. I'll see you then. Peace.